Good morning, you guys. I am nine weeks tomorrow, but we get to go into the fertility center today to look at our baby, get an ultrasound and a checkup and just see where we're at. I have no idea how much longer we're gonna be at the fertility center. I've heard that you're there till about 10 or 11 weeks, maybe 12 weeks, I have no idea. So it'll be good to get a more clear understanding today of how long we're gonna be there, how long we have to do the injections, all that stuff. Cause I'm running low on estradiol. I probably have one and I have to do it today. So I have probably one shot left and then I gotta reorder medication. So gotta figure out today how much longer we're gonna be needing to do those injections. Um, but right now I am just sipping my ice water that I can't get enough of and um, taking my prenatal. I was gonna make a smoothie, but I kind of slept in. So I think I'm gonna go to an aerobics class at the gym after the ultrasound and then I'll make a smoothie when I get home. Little nugget. Oh my word. <laughs> so fun. It's a lot more But I'm also not. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's better it's good memories, but also yeah. Yeah, 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 exactly. We get it. Yeah, we get it. Alrighty, here are your stop dates. So continue okay. the progesterone and estrogen until the fifth. Okay. Prenatal all throughout. Hope to never see you ever again. <laughs> Thanks, though. Alright guys, we did it. We graduated. <sighs> How do you feel graduating um, from the fertility clinic? 4.0. 4.0. Seems like it. Um, I didn't realize we, were, we would be graduating today. I feel kind of bad because I kind of wanted to like make them cookies or something. Bring them a oh, special gift. Oh, they can have our money instead. <laughs> well, I'm excited. The baby was looking so good. She was moving around like wiggling like crazy and um, she had a nice strong fast heartbeat because I just ate so I think she was excited. Um, so yeah, any thoughts? Um, hash brown, sausage McMuffin. <laughs> We're not going to McDonald's right now. Well, we've been talking about it with the staff for like 10 minutes. I know, but I want to go to the gym. Oh. And I don't feel like McDonald's right now, but we could go celebrate sure, later. Sure, you put up this front for the camera. You know we're going to McDonald's. <laughs> no, I'm serious. I need to go to my aerobics, aerobics high fitness class. It starts at 9.30 and it's 9, so we gotta go. Um, but anyway, so here's our little photo. Ah, so cute. Um, the 
nurse practitioner who was doing my ultrasound, she was like, you got a chunky baby in there. And I was like, heck yes. I hope I have a chunky baby. Okay, I wanted to talk to you guys about, um, at the last ultrasound, we got charged, like we got a, a charge <laughs> that we were not expecting. Um, so it kind of like put a little damper on that day. Not really, I mean, it was still an awesome day, but we were like, oh my gosh, shocked. Because when we were leaving, we had to check into the billing department and they were like, um, you have a balance of how much? $2,400 and would you like to pay that today? And we were like, what? For what? So, turns out our insurance did not cover my hysteroscopy. So, that was news to us and we had to pay a big fat fee. Um, but, it's okay. We worked through that. And But I just wanted to mention that because I talked about how we got an unexpected charge. It wasn't way unexpected, but kind of. So, I mean, it's still in the twenty two to twenty four thousand dollar yeah. baby experience. Yeah. So total. I mean, I want to do a video and and tally up everything we've spent. Maybe even include our IUI and just everything that we've spent for fertility testing and treatment and procedures. And honestly. We're close to probably twenty-eight thousand dollars. Would you say? Um, maybe. Just with IVF, I think it's like twenty-five, twenty-four to twenty-five. But anyway, so overall, though, such a great day. So happy that I don't know this little nugget in here is doing good and is chunky, and we are graduated. We stop meds on. Next Saturday, I believe. The 5th? I think that's the 5th. Um, so we stopped meds then, um, which means I still need to order Estradiol because I don't think we're going to make it through with what we have. Oh. <laughs> which kind of sucks because we literally will use that much of it. So we'll see. We're going to do it tonight. We'll see how much leftover we have. Um, but we also need to order progesterone and oil suppositories because we are almost out of those. So anyway. Should I stop using those or? <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> so, exciting day, guys. We're super grateful, super happy, and appreciate you guys following us along for all the support. Um, be sure to subscribe to keep following our pregnancy journey. And yeah, so thank you guys again, and we'll see you in our next video. Bye.